हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी अबाउट ट्रिगोनोमेट्री ट्रिगोनोमेट्री इज अ ग्रीक वर्ड ट्राई मींस थ्री गॉन मींस साइड एंड मेट्री मींस मेजरमेंट सो दिस इज ऑल अबाउट थ्री साइड मेजरमेंट ट्रिगोनोमेट्री इज ऑल अबाउट थ्री साइड मेजरमेंट how this branch came into existence our ancestors want to find the distance between stars and planets so we know that they, we cannot measure it with measure tape the distance between the stars and planet at that time a new branch of mathematics introduced and that is trigonometry so today we are going to study about the basics or you can say the introduction part of trigonometry here the trigonometry is all about a right angle triangle we know trigo means three sides so this trigonometry is all about a right angle triangle means three side measurement you know this triangle having three sides so this was three side measurement and this is all about right angle triangle so for what they had done we know we are having three sides we know one side is always this is right angle and the side opposite to that is hypotenuse this is hypotenuse and then the other two sides on the basis basis of selection of angle that two side be, can be said as opposite and adjacent if i select this angle then this side is called opposite side and this side will be adjacent to this and in the same triangle suppose this is a triangle a b c a right angle at b this is your hypotenuse but now what will happen if i select this triangle as your base no sorry this triangle as your perfect triangle angle that we want to find then this will be your opposite and this will be your adjacent so your hypotenuse will remain always the same but your opposite and adjacent will change according to the given angle or the angle which we are which we have to find like on their basis of that so now what they had done they had find out six ratios with the help of this this so one by one you have to by heart that ratio so let us start first is sin this is s i n e but we are going to use this three letter sin means you can say opposite by hypotenuse sin means the ratio of opposite side divided by hypotenuse then comes cosine cosine we are only going to use this cos that is adjacent upon hypotenuse then comes tangent that is tan means we are only using the short names that's why i am teaching you the name also but you have to use this tan this is cos and this is sin tan means opposite by adjacent opposite upon adjacent these are the ratios we had find out that one ratio we can find out by dividing this side by this side then this side by this side and at last opposite by adjacent now we can find the other these uh, ratios by doing reciprocal of this that is cosecant we are going to use five letters of this that is cosec that is reciprocal of this that is hypotenuse by opposite so this is also a ratio then next is second we are going to use only the sec that is hypotenuse upon adjacent opposite of this and at last tangent so here you will get cotangent and we are going to use only cot only this cot so that is opposite of no reciprocal of this that is adjacent upon opposite so first you should know the six ratios of this right angle triangle then we can go further but first you can you can find out this with the triangle let me let me give you one example so that you come to know suppose you are having a triangle right angle triangle abc 
if they tell you let me do this uh, this side is 3 cm this side is 4 cm and this side is 5 cm and if they tell you to find out sin a and sin c so we know sin a so here our angle is this a so we know sin is opposite by hypotenuse so what is opposite of sin a so here this is this hypotenuse is fixed this is our angle so our opposite will be bc and our hypotenuse will be ac but for sin c what is again opposite by hypotenuse but this is our angle so our opposite will become this ab and then ac upon hypotenuse is fixed now bc that is 4 cm that is 4 and ac that is 5 so this ratio will be 4 by 5 and here sin c that is uh, ab upon so that will be 3 by 5 so this way on the basis of angle whichever we have to take so opposite and adjacent will change or all, all other will remain the same so these are the basic ratios that you need to by heart then everything you will come to know slowly slowly first of all you should know this is the introduction part you can say thank you so much for watching my video if you like it please subscribe to my channel so that i can make more such videos for you thank you so much